Hi, welcome to Bonnie's Buzz. And Melody and I want to welcome you to join us here in Nantucket today for me to tell you all about my golden rules to dress by. It all starts with BLT. B, build your wardrobe with classic pieces. L, liven your wardrobe with fun novelty items. And T, tweak your wardrobe with touches of color. And that's exactly what I decided to do today. Today I'm featuring charcoal gray mixed with some beautiful sunshine yellow. And I just think the combination of the two are great, but if you're into plums with charcoal or powder blues and charcoals or pale baby pinks, it all works. It's nice to have a touch of color with a real neutral shade and in this case, it's charcoal. I'm just wearing a pair of gray leggings and a great little lightweight silk and cotton tee top and this beautiful artist shirt jacket. It's 100% cotton. It's got a great little swing to it, longer in the back and shorter in the front. And it's all hand painted. It's a mixture of grays, whites, and yellows. The collar can kind of stay up if you want, or you can push it down. And it's just, it has a placard front if you want to button it and wear it more like a shirt, or you could wear it as a jacket. But just adore it. And then I'm so thrilled to share this unbelievable piece that's all hand done with threads and silver chain and it's just this unique textural wearable art piece that just to me seems to be the accessory that can really pop something like this. And then the earrings are charcoal and black as well. And these are actually wood with a little bit of a rubber hoop. It's just incredible. And so I just love the way this looks. And then I'll do like maybe a little beaded bracelet like this, just to pick up in the yellow. Isn't that cute? And then I have a wonderful purse, and the purse is all hand woven out of straw in the shape of this beautiful star. Look at that, how this looks with yellow, of course with any color, but look at how that pops. And it's got a great handle. I'm gonna show you, it opens up, and it's all lined. I know it's hard to tell, but it's a gorgeous lining, very deep, holds a lot, great little handle here. Isn't this the cat's meow? Look how adorable. And then I'm real excited to share with you because all these pieces I'm showing you all work together and really make for a wonderful long weekend ensemble that you can pack into a little basket bag and then go away for a long weekend, which it seems like everybody's doing that. Motor trips here and there. Most people aren't flying around and they're really loving my clothes because they don't wrinkle, they're different. Look at this piece. This is made out of silk organza. It requires no sizing. It's then done with felting all by hand. Part of it has little squares the other part has little striping and the side gussets have all flowers. It's really beautiful, like a vine of flowers on the side gussets. And it's light as a feather, so it's a vest. And look at how it works, even just loose and easy and breezy with this necklace. It's so amazing to me because they all come from different people. And then, if you want to, it's got a magnetic snap here, so it just stays closed. Right here, little magnetic snap, just stays closed. You could still wear it open, wear it with a long sleeve, a turtleneck, depending on where you're going. Any color works with this. A white, black, you name it. And then this necklace can be worn so many different ways. It's hard to imagine, but there are three strands. And they're all together on silver chain. It's really unique. So what I would do if I wanted to change the look is take this, kind of close it up, 
and then take this and tie it around and I'll show you. And I see Sandra's here. Great to see you. Wish you were here so I could give you a hug. Hi, Gloria. Great to have you. Carlos, welcome. So here it is. The necklace, you can end up taking this neck and you play around with it. It's just, it's got some weight and it's very easy to kind of mold. And there I've got the jacket, I've got this vest closed because of this magnetic snap. So cute. And then I have this great looking necklace and that just as light as a feather, but it closes up the neck. And I have a mirror here and I tell you when I look in it and I see these things, I go, oh my God, this is fabulous. So I really do like my things and the earrings are so beautiful with it. What a great ensemble. Okay, so then I'm gonna take these off and the vest. And again, I always say rule of thumb is that you can hold it up with your finger, with your pinky, you know it's lightweight. Look at the design on that. Look at these flowers. Just beautiful flowers, the squares, so pretty. Then, of course, I have my fabulous signature piece, my, my fish. Here it is in bright yellow with black silicone, gold eyes. I just love it. And just to throw that on with the T-top looks terrific. I mean, that just alone, you don't have to do anything. Even somebody who doesn't know how to wear a shawl, a scarf, any kind of accessory can just throw this over their neck and it's got such a great look. And then you can actually, again, if you feel like it, go like this, wear it so that the head of the fish comes like a little shrug. The head of the fish is here. The tail of the fish is here. It's just adorable. So that with the little t-shirt really pops and it's just a great look on its own and then I have this beautiful scaly fabric very textural lightweight kind of almost reminds me a seersucker in a way it's like a little bit more modern than the old-fashioned seersucker but it definitely has that kind of weight and look at the style of this jacket and you can wear it so many different ways so it's got this great looking collar. Just can wear it open and loose and casual. And then it has this beautiful button that's a piece of horn. And that you just use right here. And if you want to, because this has like a little scaly look, you can take the scarf and literally put it under the collar. So it's like this. And that looks great. It's another wonderful way to wear it. You want to wear it open like that. That's adorable. And then I like doing this where you can really, again, change the look. You, you can button it again. This fits just about everyone. I mean, this can go all the way up to like an extra large. And I'm, I'm a small and it looks good on me. It fits so many people the way it's designed. And then take the fish and just knot it. I just love the scales of the fish with the scaly texture of this fabric. And look at this, I made it into like a Peter Pan collar. And that's a great look. I just love this. And it's so comfortable. And none of these things wrinkle. And it looks so cute just with a little touch of yellow here and here and these great little gray earrings. Okay. And then I want to show you that we also happen to have a great belt. It's just a gray belt, but it's got a little alligator and set here. And then it's a stamped alligator strap. And just to cinch in your waist and wear a great belt like that with this wonderful purse and just the earrings, not even a necklace. Easy breezy. Isn't that cute? 
Just want to show you things simple too. Let's see who we got here today. Hi, Mark. Nice to have you. Hi, Judy. Great to have you in real time. Wonderful. Hope you're doing well in West Palm area. And Saison. Hi, I hope you had a wonderful birthday. You're in Finland. Gosh, you're looking younger all the time. Okay. So now I'm going to take a totally different look in a, in a necklace. This is my slinky necklace from London. It's kind of like got gold. I'm going to try to hold it up so you can see it. Gold and silver. So textural. Looks great doubled. You can wear it double. You can wear it long. It's just one of these really versatile pieces. I'm going to take off the beaded bracelet and show you this fabulous silver mesh cuff. And I'm going to take off these earrings and show you these mesh. So it goes with the bracelet. It comes as a set. Wonderful. Looks like a hoop. Real comfortable. Real simple. Real classic. And I'll put those on. We've got on this fun necklace. You can wear it with or without the belt. And my final piece I want to show you. It's this wonderful jacket. It comes two different ways. It's totally reversible. And I have to just show you the fabric. It just blows my mind. The fabric is this gorgeous cotton fabric that has a little bit of a scaly texture to it and variegated in shades of gray with little bits of gold. And the inside is actually velvet and linen. Totally reverses and a hound's tooth. But what's fun is if you wear it on the solid side, you can just have the herringbone as the little kind of collar showing and the cuff. This is a great jacket. I would say this would fit up to a size 14. Could be as small as like to an 8 to a 14. That's how a lot of my things really fit medium, large small, medium. I like having things that aren't like exactly a size that can kind of fit a few body types and things that don't wrinkle and you can wear more than one way. Now look at that. So you're wearing the necklace with this texture, this great looking cuff, the earrings. This is great. If you want to, I have to tell you this necklace looks great up here like this or you can actually make it in a knot kind of fun just kind of twist it there's all different ways like that so it's just fun you can wear it like five six different ways there's no right or wrong it's really something you can be very creative with and I love this and then again I think it's fun to take us if you feel like you want to cinch in that waist because the jacket is a little boxy is then it's cinch, cinch it in with a belt and I want to show you the other side because the houndstooth side is really stunning. And houndstooth has been in and will be in as long as I've been around. Last 40 years of me showing clothing to people, I can't believe it. it's going to be 40 years next year that I started my own business. So you figure out. I started when I was two. <laughs> and uh, Here we go. So I wanted you to see. So now you've got this like gray little kind of textural fabric as the cuff. And you've got the hound's tooth side. And I'll take the belt off. There you go. And you've got the hound's tooth. Again, if you feel like you want to jazz it up with a little bit of a, a unique piece of artwork that you can use as a functional handbag. Look at that. What a great purse. Checks, stars. I love mixing all these textures. And so that's the show today. And everything fits into, if you roll it in a ball, into my Recipsa bag. And I am showing at Recipsa downtown. 
in Nantucket on Saturdays only from 11 to 6. And it's so much fun. And I do a live show on Saturdays from there. And I show that the bags come in all different weaves and colors. And they have all handmade things from Marrakesh. And it's been a blast. And so I hope you come and watch me either live or come in person if you're in Nantucket and say hello to me because it's really a treat. And again, I'll be showing on Thursday at 3 o'clock live here on Facebook. And then all the shows are now getting posted season two. I'm up to show nine today. And that's on YouTube under Bonnie Roseman's Fashion Buzz. You can subscribe and share me with your friends because the most important thing is that I'm booking FaceTime appointments with people. Now, people I haven't even met that are going crazy for my stuff. Usually, it's my clients. Now, it's kind of expanding out. So, anything you can do to help is so appreciated during these challenging times. I'm certainly making the most of it. I love you all. You mean so much to me. Thanks for watching. And remember... Feel good, but look even better. Mwah. See you on Thursday.